There is currently a big wedge in there. The tornado is right behind us. It's crossing right here. We gotta go! We gotta go! Go! We gotta go! right there Scott Peak reported a wedge right there West southwest wedge it's right there's there. something there look at that correlation yeah. uh. sorry oh no no it's okay I'm, I'm, sorry. I got it. I got it. I'm coming back here no no oh my god dude is that it right there is that whole thing on the ground dude Scott Peak reported a wedge right there. Serious? Yes. Dude, there's a wedge there. <laughs> Scott Peak reported it. There's a huge debris ball. There's a wedge right there. picked up right now right there dude that is holy sh Nikes that thing right there all of it Kansas. That is there is currently a 
big wedge in there. Rain's wrapped all the way around. You might be able to see it on here. Big time tornado. Yeah, see those rain bands are wrapping all the way around the front of it. It may honestly be even wrapping a little north. Nick, hurry! Yeah, they're wrapping north. Hey, we gotta go! Nick, we gotta go! Yeah, we gotta move. Go, yeah, we go. good, go! Go. Just go east. Yeah, this is this is RV. It's dusting out. I can see it. Oh wow! Oh, yeah. Right behind us, it's crossing right here. It's gonna hit this. And your rattling is about to get wrecked. Do you think <laughs> it's gonna stay up? Nope. Are you okay? Water. I'm gonna get some RFP data, wind data. At least get some. Oh. Yeah, RFP data. Yeah. Oh yeah. Are we like right behind it? Yeah, it's like 30 seconds behind it. Okay. Where are we going next, Zach? Uh, wait, no, I got it. I got it. Yeah, I'm working on that right now. I find it. I'm seeing it goes south of Eudora. Dude. I sure. Woo! I knew we were good, but I was like, if you had any trouble with that, we we yeah. ran it. I was, I was, yeah. I was gonna drop it. Like, if I was putting the propeller on. If I couldn't get on, I'm like, ah, oh, whatever. Radar. 74 outbound. That's almost 200. Yeah, the main one needs to get down. Wait, no, I, I'm an idiot. It's strong. Circulation passing either right over or very close to Bonner Springs, Kansas. Wait, so where is it right now? So right now the tornado, it's shielding that rain. On the far right side of this rain, you can see the inflow tab blowing into it. There, the very probably strong tornado is in all of that rain right there, passing either right over or very close to Bonner Springs. See, now we're starting to get southwest winds blowing into it. That's how you know it's passing right to our north. That's RFD. There's debris falling. There's leaves falling. Look at it. Right in front of us, right in front of the car. Look at all the debris flying. I don't know if that's from these trees, but it's coming like, I think it's coming from up. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, there's like little pieces of debris.
Gas is right there. Gas is somewhere right here. You can hear I it. can hear it. Uh, it's to our right. Has someone reported this damage at all yet? I'm about to. Okay, that's just gonna sit. Trying to get a hold of the, uh, I know his car was here, but they don't know if he's in. Probably yeah. no. And he's, he's, they say he worked on this side. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, then he's supposed to go to the office if there's... Yeah, it's supposed to go to what if he... What if he... Oh my god. Well then let's follow this road to the road down. Yeah. you're looking at here is a, is a very big greenhouse place like a nature place and you can see a uh, very major structural damage here uh, the buildings have basically completely collapsed we have power lines down up there good news uh, we were which I'm kind of out of breath right now we have been running around this facility attempting to find somebody uh, his car was here and we believed he was working here at the time. We did not know where that person was. Apparently that person has been found, so very good news there. We have one thing that we're trying to study is, you know, the structure of tornadoes and how the wind speeds change with height. And clearly the winds were incredibly strong here at the surface. I mean, look at this. How this piece of plywood was clearly flying from this direction and they got impaled on this tree here. I mean, that is remarkable. I mean, the amount of just force to do that is unbelievable. All right, we're gonna keep walking here. Uh, but again, we are in Linwood, Kansas, surveying some damage. A lot of emergency response now on scene. Let's flip this back around. I can see one of the trucks here that's just completely flipped on its side. I mean, that's just big time damage. As a question was asked earlier regarding my probes, um, yes, we had tornado probes in this. And uh, the biggest thing is we were trying to figure out exactly how strong the winds are at various levels. And so having our probes near this tornado while also looking at the damage can kind of give us a good idea. I think you can see trucks flipped over there. Again, we uh, are un unconfirmed reports of any injuries or anything like that, uh, so we're keeping a close eye on that. Um, and then we'll keep you updated, of course, but again, this is likely a pretty strong tornado to do some of this damage. It looks like the... Your lights are on. Lights are still going. The data log is still going on in here. Yeah, it is. Police lights just across the bridge. So the, this is right where we were sitting earlier when Nick deployed this thing. The tornado was off to our west. And literally the rain bands came over us as we were pulling away. And it's here. It got toppled, but it took some it took some data. <laughs> it just pulled the stakes right out. Oh, oh it's so waterlogged. The instruments at least were a winner. They're all still spinning. Alright, see y'all later. <laughs>